I'm geeking out about Nissan for the second year in a row because of their collaboration with Star Wars. I want to be clear, I'm crushing on you, Jeremy, because you have brought the Star Wars to Nissan fans everywhere. Yeah, that was real important for us to make sure it was done right and something that the fans would want to celebrate with us. I have been following you guys online. Last year I saw the announcement. I couldn't really afford that one. This year I've been saving up my pennies and my dollars. and I'm hoping to make my own personalized Star Wars Nissan. And we have three cars this year. Yes. You have the... The Rogue. Uh, the Rogue, the Rogue Sport, and the Nissan Sentra? Well, we uh, we have a couple of different options for fans. We did have a consumer sweepstakes that just ended that you could have personalized and won your own car, but you can still go down to a dealership with accessories for Rogue, Sentra, and Ultima and personalize it yourself with Nissan accessories that have Star Wars on it. Well, I followed that contest. I entered on both sides because it's tough, sadly, tough to choose. It's tough to choose. I wanted a red one, so I had to go Empire. Yeah, it's tough to choose the side because both of them look so great. And your display this year is super cool. Last year I loved this one, but with the fighters, with the personalized cars, did you guys work with Lucasfilm to get these all ready? Yeah, so actually we worked directly with the team at Lucasfilm and ILM that actually design aspects for the movie. And uh, we gave them our top selling vehicles and said, well, what would you create these as based on Star Wars? And they came back with some fantastic designs. Originally, we were only going to do five. And actually, the Lucasfilm team came back and said, well, we have an idea for two more. And uh, when you get a chance, try to go over to the other uh, lobby. We have Captain uh, Phasma and Kylo Ren inspired Maximus. I saw those downstairs, and I saw that little um, tablet where you're able to make yeah. the white car turn into... Oh, I was like freaking out last night. You guys are—you guys have just really made this the area to go to at the LA Auto Show this year with your droid repair over there, yep. the little driving car over there. I mean, my gosh, you guys integrated technology with your automobiles so well. Yeah, that's real important for us. Uh, technology is the future of the automobile business, and it's something that Nissan has been embracing, not just recently, but it's been for several years when we introduced Leaf several years ago, obviously, and we have a new one that just is hitting the market here soon, and we have this new platform called Nissan Intelligent Mobility that really helps people understand the technologies that are there to help make them a better driver and enjoy the drive even more. So using Star Wars, we're able to help really people understand, because there's some of those technologies like blind spot warning and automatic emergency braking that can be a little scary or almost science fiction like you're like okay i don't quite understand it seems so i can't understand it but we're using star wars as a way to help people to understand what does that technology mean to them and how does it help them i was surprised i got to test drive the 2018 nissan leaf and it is so well updated it was fun to drive yeah, really. and it is so cute yeah they did a great job redesigning it um, and it is just it's a, an accelerating drive you don't understand how it drives until you actually do it and having that instant torque right when you put your foot on the accelerator people don't understand it until you do it and it's just it's just a thrill to drive one it was a major change because i ran it the 2017 i think it was oh, yeah. and it's a big change from that and i noticed you have the added benefit of 24 months of free electrical charging. Is that just in the continental U.S. or is that worldwide? Well, right now that's in the continental U.S. Um, some of the markets are interested in doing it, but for sure here in the U.S. we're doing that. Very excited. Now, can we do a quick tour of this? Normally I'm not a truck chick, but my gosh, this is just crazy. This? Yeah, so <laughs> when we were working with Lucasfilm and the team at ILM, um, all the cars, they really came together very naturally because, you know, like Maxima seemed to really fit with certain, you know, characters or in, a, or in this case, a craft that we have out on the floor right now. And when they saw our Titan, they said, okay, that is the biggest vehicle in your fleet. We want to pair it with the biggest craft in our fleet, so the new ATM6 Walker. And when we saw the first design, we were blown away. We actually, there's not much that's changed from that initial sketch mm -hmm. to what you see behind us here. It's, it's amazing. And the sound system is what really brings it together. And that was one thing that when I was working with the team to build this, I said, I only not want to hear the sound, I want to feel it. It's a 5,000 watt sound system. I felt it when I was walking up. I was just blown away. And I'm even more blown away by these awesome cars. Now, will these be going into some sort of Nissan collection or are they going back to Lucas? Well, actually, for the next couple months here, we're going to take it out on, take them all out on tour in the auto show circuit uh, over across the country. So other fans across the country can enjoy it just as much as we are here. We are enjoying them very much. And if you guys want to have a contest or just give them away to random press people, keep you in mind okay well definitely i've got your card <laughs>
Now, can we do a quick turnaround of the car, of the truck? Oh, but I have to ask you first thing first. Sure thing. Empire Jedi. Ooh, okay, resistance or first order. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to have to go with the first order because it's just this truck is so great. <laughs> I know. You kind of checked me out of my I'm your Jedi because the first order cars are off the chain. They're phenomenal. Uh, you know, I, I am kind of a resistance individual, but... Let's face it, the First Order has some really cool craft. <laughs> <laughs> they really do. They do. So let's go check out the Titan. And of course, talk a little bit more about being able to personalize your Nissan with dealerships. And when will that be available for people? So the accessories are available right now at dealerships. They uh, delivered earlier uh, here in November, and uh, they're going to be available over the next couple months uh, until inventory runs out. So we've uh, we've got some for you uh, at your local dealer. That is so cool. Now let's take a quick gander of this. Did you do anything with the interior? The interior, we left it alone. We wanted that clean and pristine. Uh, we really wanted to celebrate uh, the, the melding of the two crafts um, on the exterior. So it starts really with the paint. I mean, that's where it really has to start and end. Um, so it was very important for us to get the color just right, the, uh, the battle scarring and the aging on the vehicle. All of this is done by hand. Uh, so we worked with some really talented craftsmen uh, to get this just right, uh, even right down to the, how we mix the paint and the type of paint that we use. Then also too, the next thing was all the lighting. We, uh, we lit the hood, we raised the hood and lit it underneath. And then we also uh, lit it really well um, in and around our headlights and uh, all the blasters and the, uh, and the different accents around the outside of the vehicle. But on this one on the hood, you can actually see right down inside uh, of the V8 engine. That's our standard V8 engine that's the uh, most standard horsepower in the class. Are these street legal? These, this particular vehicle is not street legal, but the V8 Titan is. So if you want to go to your local dealer, they have them there. Um, and then we, we wanted to keep going like and push this uh, design as far as we could. That's why we put the, uh, the blaster on top. Uh, that's an iconic part of the new, uh, the new ATM6 Walker. And then the finishing touch is the sound. We, again, we wanted to make sure we have um, multiple speakers all around this vehicle. Uh, they're actually hidden so that you don't see them. They don't interfere with the design. They're blended right in with the design. And uh, we topped it off with an 18-inch subwoofer in the back, so a total of 5,000 watts of sound system on this thing. Oh, my gosh. Can we hear the sound system? Yeah, we can. And are you guys going to have a special Nissan viewing of The Last Jedi? Yeah, actually we are. We're going to be doing uh, an opening night fan fest um, in Hollywood. Uh, we have some fans that won a sweepstakes, and uh, we've invited them to join us in Hollywood to see the movie. We're doing a little red carpet event there ourselves for the fans. Oh, my gosh. You guys are so awesome. I love Nissan. I love the new cars. I love this design. I love the app that you guys have. It's so interactive and Thank fun. Thank you. But you, this year, what, what you've done with the accessories for the Star Wars, whether you're Jedi, whether you're Empire, I know that is going to sell out really fast. Yeah, they're, they're already selling pretty fast, so uh, definitely get to your dealership right away. I know what I want to give myself for Christmas. There you go. It's a good selfie gift. All right, so this is the sound that you hear from the 5,000-watt sound system in our Nissan Titan ATM6 Walker from Star Wars The Last Jedi. Thank you so much for speaking with me, and I cannot... I'm so jealous of the fans that will be going with you to see the premiere of Star Wars The Last Jedi on the 14th of December in Hollywood. Those lucky Nissan fans, oh. but I am so happy to have spoken with you again. It was great to see you. And it is such a pleasure to see the changes you guys have made with the accessories, as well as your new automobile mini SUV that will be starting under $19,000. Yeah, this new kicks that we have is awesome. And, uh, you know, it's got a good sound system in it, too. Not as big as this, but it's still pretty awesome. <laughs> May the force be with you. May the force be with you.